We also are uh, celebrating something next week as well too. March 16th through the 20th, it is an historic exhibit of the Francophone imprint. And to explain more is Suzanne de Courier Nicole, who's the founding president, this, bear with me here, founding president of Bureau de Visibilité de Calgary. Bonjour, good morning. Hey. Bonjour, Phoenix. <laughs> I, I tell you, with you, Suzanne, I will always practice my own Francais. <laughs> this coming week, uh, there is a big event happening at City Hall. Please explain to us what it is. Well, what's happening is, uh, for the first time, uh, there will be that historic exhibit of uh, the Francophone imprint, which is the, the history of Francophones in Alberta. So this, um, this exhibit was actually produced by the um, uh, ACFA, the Provincial Association of uh, l'Association Canadienne Française, in uh, 2008. Um, and it has gone around to certain schools, but it's never been uh, publicly displayed as it will be wow. for a whole week and at City Hall. It's going to be fantastic. So, Su Suzanne, we underestimate the influence that the Francophone community has had on Calgary. Oh, yes, absolutely. And many people, it's, it's almost like the best kept secret. You know, in the beginning, Calgary was all French. Uh, the Mission District uh, that we know today uh, was at one time called Rouleauville. And so there's a whole history behind that uh, that um, I could uh, talk to you for three days. So I won't get into it. But what's happening this week is, uh, is a twofold thing. So uh, it's week two of the National Rendezvous de la Francophonie. Uh, which is in its 17th annual uh, celebrations. Uh, and that's all based around the International Day of La Francophonie, which is always on March 20th and has been since 1970. So huge celebration that day. Everybody's invited to uh, come and see us. We're in partnership with uh, L'Alliance Française. <coughs> Excuse me. Alliance Française, Portail de l'Immigrant uh, Association, Canadian Parents for French, of course, the Métis Nation of Alberta, um, and uh, uh, heading it all is the Bureau de Visibilité with um, La Société Franco-Canadienne, which is the oldest association, wow. dating wow. back to 1888. So come on out. There's lots to, lots to see, lots to learn, and um, uh, there'll be oh, f about 30 different associations at some point during the week right, right, with right, their right. information. Well, so, uh, Suzanne, French, if there's English. anything we've learned about uh, the Francophone community, that you are an incredible representative. Suzanne de Cor Corville, Nicole, founding president of Bureau de Visibilité de Calgary. Uh, cannot wait. Next week, Monday, right through Friday. Yes? That's correct. So come on down. Always a pleasure. You take care. Uh, au revoir. Thanks. Au revoir. Merci beaucoup, Phoenix. Merci beaucoup. I